jabs with the chickens. I've got to give them some feed here, so I just filled up my bucket here to go feed them. And then I've got to go get some water for them, and I'm going to start cleaning the manure out of my main coop. It's starting to go a little dirty and, and starting to small a little bit in that coop. So let's go dump this in one of the feeders. I'll probably have to come back for another bucket, and I've got to go give some to my coop where I have the chickens in that keep on getting pecked on. They have a smaller feeder, but I still gotta keep that filled up though. They have feed to eat. So let's go do that. as high as I can and shake it down in and I keep on filling it up to get it in as much as I can. That way I don't fill it as often. And she's full. So I've got to take this off. I have it on there to keep the chickens from climbing in the feeder. And it kind of keeps them from pooping in there too to keep their feed clean. So. Then I don't want to fill the feed up too full, otherwise they kick it out of there with their beaks. And then you waste half the feed that you put in. So that's about all the fuller that I fill it, just because they knock the feet out so much. So now, set this back on, and now I'm going to go get a little bit of oyster shell and grit to put in each end of the feeder for the chickens. Now I'm headed over to the house to get some water for the chickens. One thing that's different about our farm is we have a road right here that runs right through the middle of it. So we have our buildings on this side of the farm and then we have our house on this side of the farm. So in the winter I always have to come over here to the house to get uh, water for the chickens because we have a hydrant just over there somewhere by the bin behind the chicken coops that I normally get water from but I have to come over here to get water in the winter because we have to shut all of our water off to that side of the road in the winter because we have some old hog drinkers over there that in the winter they will freeze if we don't shut the water off so I just dump the water here in the drinker try not to spill any which Normally always happens. You always end up spilling some. Ah! Filled the bucket up just perfect enough to fill up the drinker. So I put my lid back on here.
cameras in here. Camera's recording though. Be sure to check us out on Instagram at Shanks Family Farm. trying to clean the dang chicken coop see you guys in the next one and like i said earlier in the video be sure to check us out on instagram and you can see what's live what's going on on the farm don't post a lot of things on there but try to post a decent amount of stuff on there check us out on there and i will see you guys in the next one